All right, welcome back. Um, if you come to where I am on the map, uh, we will quick save really quick because I can't remember what grave it's in, and some of them are very dangerous. And then we will dig around until we find it. Yeah, there's like a high level thing in there, and then there's explosives and. Yeah, there's one that explodes, one that has a level eight encounter, one that pisses off an NPC, uh, one that starts a quest for a philosopher. Uh, he wants you to read his books and come back and take a test and see if you understood what you learned. Um, and then one that leads underground, and that's the one that we want. Uh, I know for sure that these two, though, are safe to dig. Uh, and this one's Jake's group? Looks like that dog is Yeah, I can talk to the dog. Perhaps he wants to tell us something. Um, and then we take... What trickery is this? Yep. That's not Jake. That's it's not a Jake. It's corpse. a rotten sheep corpse. Yeah, that's the sheep. The lady. The lady sheep. That's where it ended up. The one from the town. <laughs> um, and then size of pie, which I will take for myself. Because it's a really good healing yeah. item. Oh. Uh, so this one's an encounter. Just behind me. This one is a quest here. Let's start the quest. That's Nemrus, the philosopher. I think this is the one that leads underground, but I'm gonna save first, just just in case. Nope, this is the encounter. Uh, too fucking high level. Load the quick save. Back it up. Rest in peace, darling. Rest in peace, darling. Um. Then is it this one that goes underground? It might also be the... That's the author guy. Yeah, Nimrus. He starts a, a quest for you where he wants you to, to read his books and then take a test to prove that you read them. You have some dinner. Thank you. Ah, here's the underground passage. I'm gonna talk with this fucker. Yeah, go for it. I'm gonna dig up this last grave and then... Oh shit, All there's right. an encounter under this one too. Uh, whoops. I wonder if I can just flee this instead of having to... Oh, she might one-shot me here. Nope, we're good. Hold on. I'm just gonna get away and flee and then we can head underground. What level is she? Eight? We can try her if you want. Jake's we... gonna go get himself killed. We're only level two, so it's probably gonna be pretty rough. Well, let's yeah. give it a shot. Yeah, I mean, we save right beforehand. There's no real harm. I'll knock her down. And that's the end of my turn. Oh! Siva's helping us too! We have a whole fucking gang here. Should be able to get free shots on her while she's knocked down, which is nice. Yeah, 23. Yeah, that's like barely anything on her though. Oh, I guess she's like an 8 down. Uh, yes, and yes. And then when she gets back up, I will battering ram her on my next turn, and hopefully we can knock her down again. We might actually be able to pull this off. Go, Murphy! If she gets up now, she'll probably attack me, because that doesn't take all her AP. Oh, she didn't attack me. I'm actually really surprised. No foe can stand before me. I didn't get a knockdown on her. That's, that's bad. Hold on. Thank you. Much obliged. Sixteen. Go dog. Oh, all right. She's a damn. Bye, dog. Oh, rip, Murphy. You, you were right there. Yeah, when she's back up, it's really hard for us because she has a lot of dodge, much higher stats than us. Your very blood heals me. Ooh, tasty. How vampiric. Bye. Jesus. Yeah. Oh, I can. Oh, I can't heal you yet. But... Not yet, but on your next turn. Oh, you got. Yo, you still get one. So. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, shit. You got to move out of the way. I don't have any AP. 
is your turn. I can move on my next one, but not this one. Alright. Oh, nice. Blinded. And... Oh, there you go. Burning. Perfect. I see just you... I say that's just to get out of the way. Alright, I'm back in that. Yeah. She's gonna go after me. Oh shit. Shit froze. Frozen. Maybe now you can learn something useful. Like how to wash your under things. Is there Alright, let's just let the save. Alright, well yeah, she's knocked down. I can kill her, but if not, she's yeah, she just has too high of a, a dex for us to hit Rest very peace, often. Darling. Just far too outleveled. I smell rotten lamb chops. Oh, he didn't give me his book, that asshole. No, he doesn't give it to you. He says that you can find it at any respectable library. Uh, and to come back to it once you've read it. Uh, I think it just, yeah, it did just auto-save for us. We're going to have a pretty hefty little fight coming up. Um... The guy who summons, I think, two or three other minions and also has a flamethrower. I guess maybe not, because this is uh, this is not tactician mode. Flamethrower guy would probably be down here, but I don't know if he'll summon any adds. So there's two skeleton bros we take out, and then flame man. This is the weird fight music. Wait and let them come to us. That's a lot of range. Yeah. Oh, and he healed himself. That's quite... No, you can't come hurt my friends. That's fine. Hammer time! Yeah, I love that. Probably save some AP. I think I'm gonna use battering ram on the mage to keep him from uh, continually healing these guys. I'm gonna move up closer and start picking off the mage. Ah, fuck! I didn't get a knockdown. On him. Battering ram's been really inconsistent for me lately. Yeah, that's right. Agrim 
You know you want to. I need a taunt of some sort, really. A little help here. Shit. Yeah, the battery ram probably was the bad bad idea. Both to me. It's a oh, it's it's a super good skill. Uh, I just don't. Oh yeah, his arms is high enough yet to really. Oh no, it's just because the other two are behind. Don't worry, I'm coming for you. Thank goodness, I pulled aggro. Hopefully that stays for the rest of them. Shoot. Nope. Alright, well, I'm not gonna do this without you, so let's just reload and I will not die of the mage this time. My Give bad. me a second to set up. Yeah, for no, sure. Not to, let me set up something different. But, um, stay back. Let yeah, me hit them with, with 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 some stuff first. Because I can't really blast with magic when you go up front. So. Right, right. I will just, I'll be a wall between you and them this time. I will do my job as a tank. Let me, uh... Alright. Okay. Okay, I'm down here now. Once we get through this area, then we'll have more than enough money and I can go get like a decent weapon too, and then it won't be, I'm literally doing like four damage to them because of their armor right now. I've got like the shitty starting one-handed sword. Uh, I get to the tiny choke point and then just hang out. Yeah, fire bomb, that's fine. Stats. So he gets an opportunity attack. So does he. All right, then I won't. Move. Oh, the bottom one is uh, almost is close to dead. So it, uh, yeah, ten. I can probably finish him off. Ah. Oh, yeah, if they didn't get attacks of opportunity, I was going to move because I'm flanked right now, which is part of why. Oh, he healed so much damage. Can't kill them. Um, but. I move, they both get a free attack on me. Thirty-five. That's a good fucking chunk of damage. Done. Nicely done. Very nice. I'll go forward. I think it, it's it's just the well the one the one that you bought is really good. So. Oh, the wand. Yeah. That's good. I've got uh, two turn cooldown before I can heal you again, so... No worries. I've got a uh, cure wounds and a healing potion if things get hairy. Oh. And only one of them can attack right now because I'm knocked down, so... It's dead. We should be, should be pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna take this turn to cure wounds. Good, good. And then move off one. Us. That's good. Oh, what am I? Oh, damn it! I hate when this does it. I'll be behind him. I've got enough HP. I can. Uh, I can heal you now. 
This, uh, that's good, but I'll hit him first. Out of this one alive. Uh, thank you. Just cursing arrows and a crossbow for you if you want them. Oh, I need to die. Make sure that we're ready before this next thing, because this next fight's even a little bit harder. If it's even on tap or on normal mode. Okay, so nice, quick work. save. Yeah, there he is. Little flamethrower. Yeah, and he does bring his ads. So this fight is mostly okay, but if flamethrower dude gets close to us, he can do this cone of fire attack that we might see even right now that will just absolutely ruin our day. Uh, so you want to maintain a pretty healthy distance from him. From the tiniest spawn! I hang, move back a yep. bit, make him go through the fire. Yep. The smoke will cause the archers to have to get closer to. Nice. Burning, burning, burning. Ah, this is the cone of fire I was talking about. Pretty close to me. Uh, I can throw some cure wounds on you as well. I'll, I'll talk about I can. Um, I would just suggest we move back a bit, and then you cure yourself, and I can heal myself too. So. so my plan is to batter them. Knock him down. Nice. So that we can gain a little bit of room to breathe, and then how much does it cost? It costs two to drink a healing potion. And we'll back this far. Sweet relief. Got a potion or something? You should probably just keep healing yourself. Yeah, I've got, I I hit, I used my uh, spell. Nice. Seven, eight, Are you eight. kidding me? Fucking like eighty percent chance. Nice. Ah, son of a bitch! I meant to attack him and it walked. I hate that. I'm gonna die. What? Okay, you say so. Yeah, I was trying to attack him with my wand and it sent me over. Yeah, uh, that's what's happened. That was my bad. Okay. Give me one second here. I will change my scrolls around. Sure. Yeah, if you can craft some special arrows too, like I think I sent you some knockdown heads. Uh, knockdown arrows can really help. It's almost a guaranteed stun. Uh, 
Yeah, I've, I've got some knockdown arrows too, so let me get those on there. I can craft a couple, I think. Let me see what I have. Yeah, if you have knockdown or shock arrows or static cloud arrows, all three of those do stuff. Or CC of some sort. Knockdown is technically not stuff. Knockdown, this thing might apply. Okay. I'm going to hop up real quick while you're doing your skills. I'll be right back. Yep, I've got them. Yeah, I've got some knockdown arrows. I equipped them. Uh, they're equipped now. Could I steal a dinner from you? I don't think. I think we saved before you gave me one earlier. I do not have one in my inventory right now, and I don't recall eating one. Or oh yeah, give, yeah. Give me, give me, give me, give me one second. Yeah, just something that I can eat to to restore the rest of this life before we head into battle. There you go. And. There you go, there's some food. Thank you much. Let me put these on my hot bar. I'll consume one preemptively. Yeah, man. Alright. Alright. This should go a little bit better. Hold on, get back here. Okay. Should I sneak up on him and try to get a, an early sneak attack? Just gonna do that preemptively as well. Because it has it, it, the cooldown starts a little better ah. during. Ah, fuck! I snit, failed my sneak attack. Well, now I'm in a pretty, pretty bad spot. Actually, this is okay. I can come back to right in front of you, and I don't think they can get around me at all. Damn, double fail. Get back. <laughs> oh nice, they failed their attack of opportunity because it's like, that is really super nice. Yeah, he has to move maneuver around. He's not gonna have the AP to do his major attack. Yeah, definitely. Alright, uh, so I can get a knockdown on him this turn, which is nice. 90% chance of knockdown. Not guaranteed, but close. Nice. No, I didn't get the knockdown. Oh! Damn, but he's burning. XCOM begin. Um, I think I'm going to stay here, because he's going to be close enough now to use the fire cone either way, but at least we have some distance between us, so it should only hit me and some of both of us. Okay. Well, my, uh... I'll be able to add to your, yes! your healing. Yes! Knocked him down with battering ram. Nice. I can, uh... Their, uh, their, their, their chance to hit is... Now you will know the reach is, uh... Of to fucking hit this guy. You you were right there. Move <laughs> <laughs> back once. Yeah, I'm gonna peel back towards you as well because he's off knockdown. Oh he yeah, oh nice. The the smoke screen still affected his attack of opportunity. Yep. Oh and these guys are getting out. Nice. Ooh. Man, they really don't like you. And I have nothing that can actually generate aggro for now. Ha! <laughs> he killed his own dude. And he missed you, so everything worked out actually pretty alright there. 
Thank you. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, opportunities are really asshole in this game. Um, should I heal and hang here and try to catch the aggro of the other guy and the skeletal scorcher, or should I come back towards you and hit this sword? What are your thoughts? Ah, uh, son of a gun. Um, I could heal and say... get a swing on the scorcher. Or I could yeah, I, I would. I suggest you do that. Okay. Sweet, and he's on fire. Both of us are on fire. Okay, perfect. They're going after me. <laughs> yeah, they really, really don't like you. Back on my feet again. Are you dead again? Yeah. What the they, hell? They, Did they... archer get you? This is... No, the, the Skeletor Scorcher had two attacks. Oh, I thought that he wouldn't have to after moving that far. No, yeah, he has enough AP for that. Um, Okay. New plan. Hang right here. I'm going to run back to town and go get a companion that we don't need to do a quest to get. And then I'm going to bring her back down with us and we're going to fuck these guys up. We can get a uh, ranger in town for free. All we have to do is talk to the guards and say, hey, don't worry about jailing her. I'll be responsible for her crimes. And they say, okay, bro. She's a little crazy, but uh, she's a good fighter. So should work out. And I think she's higher level than us. I think she's three when you get her. Hey, who's that then? Come on, stand where my good eye can see you. Easy, Tull. That's the source hunter you're talking to. Yeah, that's right. I'm the source hunter. She may have the look of a woman if you squint hard enough, but she's no more than a wild animal. We got reports of a strange-looking outsider skulking through the town with her bow drawn. I found her crouched behind a tree, taking aim at a fat old rat trotting along the city walls. That's I tapped gross. her on the shoulder to see what was what, and the beast startled like a wild cat and lunged right at me. Bit Tully right in the face. She Bit did. in the face. It wasn't I love pretty, that. This and now it's is, got uh, a chunk ripped like off it. Partially boot. feral. She's raised by bears. And she <laughs> <laughs> the guards Canberra. in the face. There's not another legionnaire in the cohort that'll have you. Guard obviously rabbit. deserved it. I agree, but she doesn't. Well, that's to be decided. She doesn't seem to be sick, despite Tully's moaning. Um, it'd be worth taking well, that's a relief, this stranger under my wing. We found a good Heed me, source hunter. And then we'll take her equipment back. Uh -oh. Here. Send to Bardoir. Do we want her to use bows and arrows, or do we want her to use her dagger? A dagger be fine. Are you sure? I could give you her bow and arrow if you want. And uh, and her special arrows if you want to kind of specialize in it. Sure, why not? Okay. Um, and she also I've got has a scroll of resurrection that I can take off of her, so I can bring someone back now, too. Uh, so I just sent you her bow and her arrows, and I'm going to equip her. Oh, do you need a dagger for her or something? No, she's already got a dagger. I have some them. better ones. Both. Uh, you can send uh, them to her if you want. Uh, just click on them and right-click on them in your inventory. And click if she has, does she have dual wield? She 
No. Okay, well, I sent her a dagger that's really, really good. Sweet. Uh, let me equip that on her. Sweet. Alright, on my way back. With companion in hand. I can remember how to get back to the graveyard right now. Over here? Yeah, we got it still. Stop now, we're almost to the graveyard. Alright. I have Don't friends. mind Don't mind the moving bush in the dungeon, it's perfectly normal. Nothing to see here then. <laughs> Alright, we will re-quick save. Uh, oh. And I will eat dinner. Consume. And I will send you all of these delicious cooking ingredients. save. Alright, this should hopefully go a little bit better. Uh, and I'm going to put her in this formation so she's behind me. Alright. Yeah, just let me know when you're ready to pop the encounter. Gonna move back after the smoke grenade. <laughs> uh, bond wall. Oh, I get to control her too. Interesting. Bond wall. Uh, you come up to right here. That's how we will set our, our beach head up. And just in your turn. Uh, you. No, I cannot use this in the smoke, so I will just move back to here. Yeah, they, they'll have to move quite a bit of ways forward to do anything. Oof. Yeah, just 15. Not bad. Alright, let's see what the range on this thing is. I should be able to get him a knockdown this turn, so it should be, should be A-OK. -okay. chance to hit. Yeah, we'll go for that. So we're going to knock down on my turn and there's no real risk of her taking the damage. But probably will knock down on my turn. We'll see. Yeah, we got it. <laughs> Every I just gave him time. Send her to Confound it. God damn. <laughs> Seven hands. I'll save my AP. Fucker got in the way of my uh, uh of me shooting at the big guy. I have no idea why. Yeah, it's very strange. I don't know how I grow in this game. Okay. Yeah, it's very strange. 
and him. Not enough action points, he's right fucking there. What do you mean not enough action points? What's this? Um, well then, I guess the best thing that we can do is move here. You battering ram him for the knockdown. Perfect. Salt on fire, god damn it. Nice, one down. Jump. Yeah. Uh, Knockdown arrow and uh You should be dead soon. I can heal you in a bit. Uh, it's already my my uh cooldown's up. I'm going to spend this turn just coming back and getting between you and them. Yeah, they just seem to go straight for me, it's pretty funny. both of his allies, so it's just us versus him now. As long as we can keep ourselves alive, we should be alright. Like being kicked by a troll! Move back a bit! <laughs> Good plan. We will do the same. I'm just gonna bring it back. Oh, opportunity. I forgot he had that. Um, potion. I will treat my wounds. Nito burrito. Is a knockdown error. Nice. Alright, now Maybe we're all now fucking on fire. Let's get out of here. Like how to I'm Saw a barbed wall. Well, okay, I guess I'll revive her. Uh, wait till the fire goes out before you bring her back up so she doesn't just light on fire again. Here, I'll let you do it. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, yeah, yeah I do. Sweet. 
Empty mug. Oops, this empty mug. No, just throw a cup at it. I'm sure that'll work. I have a cup of tea. Maybe that'll work. Oh, actually, wait. We can wrestle without the fire. Though. I forgot that you teleport. To you when you them. Back on my feet again. Uh, but we should definitely. Oh, that flask. Up. Poison flask. Empty mug. Mug of water. Cinder rudder. There you go. Yeah, unfortunately you can't use a mug of water. It has to be like a water scroll or a... Uh... Oh, Bartoua, you dumb... No, no. You stay away from that fire. Okay, it's gone. We're good. I don't uh, have the and right we also tool dinged, for so mining. Time to... Time to get stats. seems to fortify your abilities. <laughs> it's easy enough to get new strength. <laughs> I figure this lady's a bitch. On one's shoulders. Have no fear, my friend. I'm determined to prove oh, my God. worth to you by our journey's end. I'm still trying to figure out what I want to take. There's no rush. I'm going to go grab our other companion while you steal it. Just around the corner. He's deaf. Or he's not deaf, he's mute, rather. He's really fucking good at sneaking. You see a shady looking figure, so absorbed is he in his coin hoarding, that at first your friendly tone of voice has immediate and mute. Excitedly, names Walgraf. I admire you. Now here I like Source Hunter. He Walker says, nods I've been enthusiastically birth, and, I'm and pulls a, beggar, a couple of ripped no parchment pieces out from his vest. Hastily, he covers them. Been mute since I was a kid. Man, food where I can. Steal it. Want to help you? I'm useful. Want a Walgraf? Yes. Definitely. Walgraf smiles and shakes your hand in thanks. Um, he's got some okay items. I just sent you a red scroll that he had. Split his healing potions as well. Send to Roderick, send to Gus. Cool. Now we've got a sneaking dude. There's a ton of gold around here to pick up on the ground. Not a ton. Is there anything else in this old underground shit? Yes, there is. If we go this way, uh, Tunnel that leads up to that locked general store, and we can pilfer a few thousand gold worth of stuff from it. Um, oh! But it's kind of a bit of a pain in the ass to navigate, so I'm actually going to give you. Can I not? Oh, I can't force her to join up with you. I'm going to give you our other companion, uh, and I'm actually going to detach even the new guy we just got from myself. Uh, and I'm just going to run it all with him alone. Because it's really easy to die in this section. Wolgraf spotted a trap. Yeah, there's a trap. But we don't have any. Oh, yeah, actually, Roderick has stuff to disarm traps. Hopefully, it doesn't blow up in my face. I don't know if it's a skill check or not. Okay, we're good. Uh, so we just 
food. We don't have anything to mine with right now. What's in this chest? You're two-handed, right? Uh, no, I, just, I haven't taken anything yet. Ah, fair enough. Well, okay. Oh, there's a lore thing up here. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, I have uh, items for you then. Send this to Roderick. Let me get to identifying. Well, this is pretty good, I guess. Uh, send to Gus. This I need, but I will give you the ones that I was wearing because they're better than yours. And. Ooh, those are real good. Uh, I will equip these and then we'll give the other ones to. How's Bordeaux with armor? Can she wear armor well enough? No, not really. Do you want plate armor or do you want to keep your movement intact instead? Uh, leather armor is fine for, for uh, her. I'm going to give this to Bardo Tuar then. Uh, I did send you Feral Bear Girl's old leather armor. It might be better than the leather armor you have. I'm not sure. Is this where we go to get to it's... the... Just a bit better, but I, it, it's just a bit better than, than what I've got right now. I'm trying to figure out what I want to. Uh... I'm just kind of a jack of all trades, to be honest. Not sure what I want to specialize in something yet. I'll yeah, hold yeah. on to my point. Yeah, I'm holding on to my point as well. There's no point in rushing it. I'll give this to. Oh shit, this is a really good bow. I'm definitely sending this to you. And. I will take this ring because it improves War Master even further. Oh, cool. I can give uh, what's her face back her bow. Here you go. <laughs> she has her bow back. Nice. Um, I'm trying to remember where down here we access that. Wait, what? Oh, this is a French rat. <laughs> so there's someone called Brachus Rex that the skeletons are discussing. Brachus Rex. Yes. But yeah, the, the, the rat was French. That's really funny. Where the fuck is this exit? There is an exit somewhere down here. There are two exits. There's one that I just went through and got us that bow. But then there's another one that leads deeper into this cavern. Is it under here? Or is this a mining thing? I don't have the right oh, tool mining. for mining. Is it up here? No, that's the one that I just went through. Uh... Somewhere in here. You say you will take me under your wing, but I see no feathers. Are you a child of the birds? In truth, this is. And so the lonely babe was fed upon the wild mothers, the wise. I think it's really God unfortunate Wolf, that it doesn't show you the dialogue that I'm going through with these Threes people. Among her pretty cool backstory. So you see, I have good company. Threes it does actually in the uh, I, the, the little uh, the dialogue area oh, okay. in the screen, freely, but it's just friend. kind of it's yeah. just so small to read. There's also like a screen you can go to and review the past dialogue. There's, it would be cooler if it popped it up and like brought us all into the conversation, you know? Yeah, it would be. That's... I wonder if they made that improvement for the second one. I'm almost certain I have they did, learned all but the remembering I'm not sure. Of the we do not it is different. At he least, came to me I don't when know. I was it might depend on the NPC, Jared. because like I said, there's a lot of a lot of independent, like, non-connected stuff I do not you can do in the second one as well. Where, oh, where has this exit gone? Maybe it was farther back behind him? I don't have the right tool for mine. Maybe I'm going the wrong way? I'm just crazy? Oh, please don't set off that mine. Please don't. Okay, we're good. Where are you? Oh, I found it. I found it. 
Okay, I'll have to go back towards you. Um, I went to talk to all the rats I missed. Well, like I said, I'm actually going to split off our party, and I'm going to just take just the new guy we got through this section oh, alone. Spotted a trap. Because he's very trapped up. But if you just take one person through, you can actually make it through fine. Uh, shit, I said as I poisoned myself. Just run, just run. Just run. Yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah, he will actually pop out in town uh, momentarily. Well, not momentarily. It's easy. Do I have lockpicks? Do you have lockpicks? Yeah, I do. Uh, it's okay. I have some. I just have a sense in the wool graph. There you go. Uh, I'm gonna send this to you because you have blacksmith. In. And send this to Roderick and this to you because you're a crafter. What do I have? Open. Suddenly, motion's a sign of warning. There's a dangerous spot somewhere around here. Well, you don't say, Wolverine. Oh. I will send the wolf wolf graph because I've got the lockpicks. They're in his inventory now. Sweet. I got him stunned, so I'm just waiting. Oh, do you want a helmet? Uh, Roderick could use one. There you go. Is it the lucky fucking goggles? No, it's... Uh... What is this journal? I don't think I got this last time. Oh, yeah, I did. This is about when the general store closed and the guy got really pissed off. Tough shit, man. Uh, that's capitalism. All right. Into the general store to take all of the things. Painting, 700 gold. Divine Light skill book. Wolgraf spotted something. Painting, 600 gold. Ruby, 300 gold. Painting, 600 gold. Ornate chest. With stuff that Roderick can identify. Uh, and a book? What is this book? He Who Smells It, Volume 3. Fantastic. Alright, so Wolgraf is back in town now. Uh, I think that we can probably just take our people back up to town again. And uh, then I unfortunately have to hop off because work called while we were playing and they need me. All right. But let's get up to town first and divvy up this loot. I'll identify some stuff because I think I have more equipment for you now. And then, uh, then we can call it a... Okay. Call it a night. I'd like to hit a solid hour with this video in a way. Well, Graf, can you join us? Link them all together. Let's do some identification. Yeah, these are good robes for a mage. I'll send these to you. Oh yeah, here you go. Can you identify these things? Yes, I should be able to identify pretty much anything we found so far. Oh, this blackjack is sick. That's a really good one-handed weapon. These are for thieves, so I'm going to give them to Wool Graph. Oh, shit, it's a tough call. I think I want this sword, actually, instead of this blackjack. Um, we can give the blackjack to Bartle Claw. No, that dagger that you gave her is still better. Yeah, that 
That I just found on the beach. Actually, we'll give the black or the dagger to Wolgraf, because he's a dagger guy. And we'll let Bard the Squar take her um, bow back. And then I have bartering, so if you have anything of value, send it to me. And then I also found some mages' skill books, or one that I will send to you. Uh, crafting thing that I'll send to you. No, hold on. What do I have in my inventory that I can throw your way? Oh, you. Yeah, here you go. I will uh, send you some uh, old stuff to sell. Yeah, anything, anything to sell that you have, just send it on over to me. Oh shit! I should give you this book. Uh, send to. Yes, I just gave crafting recipes. Oh, no, you want to keep this knife. Uh, that knife can be used to cut a number of different things for crafting. Um, oh, okay. You can use it to cut, like, I think, I want to say food for cooking and whatnot. Um, put consumables in my backpack. Bucket on my head. I don't play armor for this one. Oh no, I gave it a one. Uh, which one? Right? Sweet. And it's better than his other dagger. I'm not sure it is, but I don't think he can backstab it, so we're not going to give it to him. So Santa's eh? Oh, if you've got a favourite sheep, best to fry her up now before she gets thieved in the night like me dear plump ogget. The finest in me herd. Oh, let me now the herd's gone, old Birch is just scratching by like a hen till the next batch of I've got the answer, so... I recently sold most of the tender loves to a trader heading north. Plenty of business that way these days. That's yeah, I have the answer for her. Preparing for a mighty great feast. Oh, oh ogget. There it is. Oh, me poor sweet There it is. You've been wasted entirely. All that roast. All the mutton. No, it just I'm in the same dialogue. Give her a will ya? Oh cool. Me little mouldering darling. What a weird lady. You call to Wolgraft. He awaits your queries. Um, oh no, I don't know what I'm Mm -hmm. About time the council took note. Potions to be muscle you, scrolls to entossle you. Yeah. Sweet. Let's see. These yeah. damn birds won't fetch more than a pittance. Yeah. 